Yes, we. Uh, this is Osh County Utilities Emergency Dispatch. We found a human skull. Oh my gosh! What's the location? Please? It's right off of Suburban and Chickasaw in the Kelly Anthony area, right by the. Oh. It just wasn't meant to be. Do you think the parents were involved, the grandparents were involved? I think the parents are going through the very worst time they've ever went through in their life. Everything was against us on that search, including the people that was supposed to care for, and that was mother, grandmother, grandfather, and uncle. Tim Miller of Texas Equisearch is on the witness list to testify in the murder trial of Casey Anthony. He organized massive searches in 2008 for little Kaylee Anthony, and he used these photos and maps to show us where his team searched for the missing two-year-old. More than 4,000 volunteers were recruited and resources pulled from all over the country. Our Kawasaki mule here, we had some uh, volunteers in Florida that were using this mule, and we was across the street from the school, and it's basically 200 feet away from where Kaylee's body was found. They ran this mule in the water, and the water was this high. Water went in the motor, and that was on our, our first search. And that was right, you say 200 feet from where they found? Uh... 200 feet, wow. 200 feet. The initial search began in August of 2008, but high water levels left by Tropical Storm Fay forced Miller to call off his search after a week. We tried to search this area. We tried to search this area and the water was too high in an area probably right in here somewhere, I'm gonna say, is where they sunk the mule up to about three feet deep. In November, two months after the first search, Miller and his team came back to Orlando to try again. I came back a second time when I was flying in and, and I was looking down from that airplane and I says, conditions are not nearly what I thought they were going to be. We set up another big search and, uh, and we were right back in this area again. And where her body was found, there is actually, uh, there's actually kind of like a swale that goes down there. We had a searcher that was literally, and she's a member, and we took her in from here, and she's, she's a very, very good searcher. There was literally eight feet away from Kaylee's body that second time in there. And she called me on the phone. And she said, Tim, she says, you know what, there's just a lot of stuff out here that looks like it shouldn't be here and stuff, but we can't search it all because it's, it, you know, it's, we're still almost knee deep in water. What, what kind of things spots. was she talking about? Just a bunch of debris and there was a couple little toys out there, stuffed animals and things. The Orange County Sheriff's Office directed Miller to several areas based on pings from Casey Anthony's cell phone. But after searching several areas around Orlando over three days, Miller suspended the second search. Breaks our heart to leave again without finding Kaylee. No way in the world would I ever believe that Kaylee is still alive, but I will support the Anthony's in, in anything that they're going to try to do. Almost six months after Kaylee was reported missing, her remains were found by a meter reader less than a quarter mile from her home. So it was right here, yep. right here, yep. where the body was found. We were standing there at the, at the crime scene tape and two of the investigators came down and actually got us. We were the only two civilians that went to that site where Kaylee's body was found. And when I looked at that site, it was like, it was impossible to find her.